Hello everyone. I hope you are doing well and that you had a nice weekend. So today is going to be a very quick video. I am just going to check in and talk about what I want to do for the next one. Because I was supposed to film this weekend, but I wasn't feeling very well. I got a little sick. And so I decided to do the video that I had planned on Wednesday because it's a little bit involved. Wednesday we have a public holiday here in South Korea, so on Wednesday I will be filming the more involved video that I had planned. So today I'm just going to talk about what that video is going to be. So I have this traveler's notebook that I bought at one of the art stores here or stationery stores that I really love. My mom actually bought me this cover when she came to visit me and then I bought the inserts. This was the first one I saw here, the traveler's notebook, so I immediately snatched it up. It's not leather, it's rubber. And then it has two elastics, but it has space for four inserts. So the first one, this is my personal writing journal and that one is full. It has the most beautiful cover, foiled like that. And then there are two plain ones just with lines. And then this is another beautiful one here that I'm also going to use for my personal journaling for writing. And then this one is also just lined. However, I want to make some new inserts for this traveler's notebook. And I want to add some things in the pockets like stickers and washi and just some pretty decorations. And then also there's this pocket at the back and stickers that also come with the inserts. But I just wanna kind of zhuzh this up a little bit and make it more my own. So I'm going to be making inserts for this traveler's notebook. And that is what I want to film on Wednesday. And that's going to be quite involved because I want to dye some papers and make the insert a little bit more junk journal-y in the sense that it has going to have different kinds of papers and different colors and some patterns and lined and you know just different kinds of papers so that's what i want to do with this traveler's notebook so to give you an idea of the papers that i'm going to put in that i'm going to show you the personal journal that i'm currently working in this will have I have a video dedicated to it when I'm done with it and also I will be doing some journaling sessions like journal with me's in this book so I'm not going to talk about this book too much uh, I will do that in my first journal with me in this but so the idea that I have for the inserts in here is very much similar to this book so this book these purple pages are fabric dyed actually so i use fabric dye to dye the papers and again i got this idea from johanna she talked about papers that she made a journal with and she said that oh they're not tea and coffee dyed she used fabric dye and i was really curious about that and of course you can get lots of lovely colors so i bought myself some fabric dye and i went online to research how do you use fabric dye to dye papers? So you basically just mix it with some hot water and you paint it on the page and you let it dry. But I'm going to show you how I fabric dye my paper on the video that we'll be shooting on Wednesday. So that is why it's going to be a little bit more involved. I wanna show you how I fabric dye and then also how I tea and coffee dye because I'm going to tea and coffee dye on Wednesday as well so this is a tea and coffee like a mixture or this was just tea I don't remember but so this was with tea and coffee and then this one is with fabric this is printed eco dye paper so here's another coffee one and then fabric dye so I have a few different colors I actually mixed red and blue to get this purple um, I don't have a purple dye, and I wanted a dark one, so I mixed it myself, and I was very happy with how it came out. And then also, I will be dyeing some line pages. So, I want to make inserts that are kind of reminiscent of, of these pages. Only, it's of course going to be on a smaller scale. This is a notebook. 
with some lined paper and so the inserts are going to be obviously less paper uh, in each insert but I wanted to be this kind of variety in in the inserts I mostly write in them but I want them to you know look a little pretty I do some decoration like washi or sketches or doodles for the most part I just write but I want it to look like this um, have some variation so yeah I just wanted to check in and tell you guys what the plan is for Wednesday so that I at least have a video up I feel like I've waited a little bit too long this time and like I said I will do a dedicated video on this book and some journal with me's but yeah so that is the plan for the next video so I'm going to be showing how I dye my papers and then also how I actually make the inserts like cutting the sizes and then sewing them together and then putting this thing together it might be more than one video so on Wednesday I might show all the preparation like dyeing the papers and choosing them and cutting them down to size and then on my next video which will probably come out on the weekend um, I will show putting the the notebook together and decorating it and also decorating the covers of the inserts and all that good stuff so I know this video wasn't really all that exciting um, and it didn't really teach you anything I but I just did want to check in and tell you that hey I'm here <laughs> I'm still working on stuff and then I will give you that very involved wonderful video on Wednesday so I hope I will see you guys then thank you so much bye